Hello, whenever you order snow melt or slab heating cable, you should always test each cable or mat to make sure that it's in good condition before it gets buried in the concrete. The last thing you want to do is install a mat that's been damaged in shipping into the concrete and then you go to turn it on and it doesn't work. So the way that you test these mats or rolls, whatever you have, or cables, is to get a mega ohmmeter. There are two kinds of mega ohmmeters. There's the old fashioned hand crank mega ohmmeter, which we don't really suggest using anymore, so we're going to hide that one. And what we suggest using now is the electronic mega ohmmeter. Each roll or each cable that you put in to the system needs to be tested with a mega ohmmeter. If you don't have a mega ohmmeter, you can rent one from Warmly Yours or you can find them locally. Many electricians have them. So what uh, a mega ohmmeter does is it actually tests the insulation between one of the um, uh, electricity carrying uh, wires inside the, the system to ground. So what we're going to do is we're going to test, this is a 120 uh, volt system because you can see one wire is yellow, one is black. If this were 240, this would be red and this would be black. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be testing across the yellow to ground and then we'll be testing from black to ground to make sure that anywhere in the mat or in the cable that these current carrying wires are not coming in contact with the ground. So to do that, I just take my black clamp and I attach it to the ground. I then set my mega ohmmeter to 500 volts. And at that point, I take this wire and I am going to go, um, I'm on the ground now, so I'm going to go from yellow to ground and I'm testing it and it tests infinity, which is good. Sometimes it'll say OL, depends on what you're getting there. But what you wanna do is that means that nowhere in the cable is this current carrying wire touching ground. Now I'm halfway done. The next thing I do is I go from black, which you may not be able to see very well because it's behind the clamp, We'll try to do it that way for you. And we will then press and hold down the test button again. This is 500 volts. Once again, this is very dangerous amount of current flowing through this wire. Do not put your fingers on the wires when you're doing this. And I'm getting infinity again, which tells me I have no continuity between the black conductor and ground all the way through the mat or the cable. Each single mat or cable that you get should be tested this way before, during, and after installation to make sure that nothing has happened to it. And when you go to hook it up, if everything goes well, your system will work like a million bucks. Thanks for watching.